people just play the controller lottery like honestly, you know? The, like the worst controllers. <laughs> yeah. Like controller Johns were everywhere before. They still are, but for not in the same way. No. Because now there's solutions out there, you know, so. Now, there, now people know the problems and know the solutions as well. I'm not scared of getting battlefielded there. Yeah. Just go straight into the ledge. Oh, and again, I'm still getting in with this standing needle. I'm so we'll definitely have to win neutral a lot to win the set because any situation where he's going to be off stage is going to be death. Like. Yeah. Or at least a ton of damage. Yeah. But keeping it close here. Three stocks apiece in uh, game one, and we did actually not strike to Dreamland this time. Maybe uh, Ice noticed that Amsa used it as a counter pick, and he's like, no, I'm not going to give you two Dreamlands. Ooh. Oh, very smart by Ice, <laughs> now by Amsa there to use his jump underneath Battlefield to avoid the, the Shine Spike from the ledge from Ice. Mm -hmm. Saving jumps. Yeah, again, Ooh, he escapes he, it. Yeah, Ice always looking for it. He calls it the the triangle of death, like this uh, mm. triangle coming out and down from Fox on the ledge, where he can just drop and shine on you. Yeah, it's like always stay out of the triangle of death. I think Amza avoided it with a really well timed fastball. Mm -hmm. All right, up throw, and he gets the the forward tilt out of it and I'm very mm. surprised uh, Ice let that happen because the only way she can get a follow up out of an up throw other than tech chasing on a platform is if you DI in front of her. If you yeah. DI up or behind her it doesn't connect to anything. Okay. Let's see here Ice Trying to make it difficult for Amsa to get back on. Oh, I like that four there. That's really good when they DI inwards. Oh! And Ice converts that into an up smash. Not going to be quite enough, but this back air might just be enough. <laughs> Jumping laser back to the ledge. <laughs> I but, love that. Yeah, gets up <laughs> a bit too early, though. It's like a ghetto version of what Sheik does. Let's see here. Yeah. This Toda. time. It's not gonna let Amsa back on. So we actually saw Ice drop an edge guard there. So let's hope uh, it stays crisp and doesn't let that happen. Oh too my often. goodness. Ice going ham right now. Oh. I'm surprised the grab didn't work for uh, for Ice either. That was such a quick shield drop into Nair. Oh, Ice oh, just ice stalking him around over the stage. It's <laughs> just <laughs> dash attacking. And still <laughs> dies for it though. Amsa, not about to be that was the, on. That was the Windmill of Fury. Yeah, but this Fox is Fox Edition. Yeah. Gets the Shine Spike, sends Amsa underneath Battlefield, and that's a very rough position for Sheik to make it back. Damn. Just Ice was completely in his head in the last two stocks. All right. Amsa going to Yoshi's this time. Interesting. Yeah. Oh. I guess he uh, doesn't want to give Ice the space to move around. Yeah. But you know, wow. I, and you know, uh, some foxes think that this is a, a fox counter pick. Yeah. But I also can see the arguments for why it would be good for Sheik because yeah. usually you want to be in a position to get edge guards on the fox, yeah. and this stage lets you get edge guards, you know, more than any other stage, just because you're always closer than the ledge yeah. than uh, than anywhere on Pokemon Stadium, essentially, you know. For sure. Doesn't matter though. Ice taking the first stock quite convincingly. <laughs> I'm still trying to catch him coming off the platform with that rising up air, but mm. Ice waiting it out. Wishful thinking. Mm -hmm. Ooh, big forward air. Mm. Yeah, lets him get back. Yeah. Not that much you could do though. Yeah, I think you could do a run off Nair would have mm. been fast enough, but it's super risky because you have yeah. one frame to input the Nair, yeah. and if you hit it, uh, input it any later than that, you just die before you can recover. Oh yeah, yeah, it's very tight actually. Yeah, it's super tight. It's maybe the most technical thing you can do as she. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see here. Yeah, I'm sorry. Holding yeah. the ledge, but uh, um, Ice uh, air dodging past it, knowing that he's not at a high enough percent where he can get a, you know, our Amsa can get a big juicy combo uh, as a punish off of it. Hmm. 
<laughs> Honestly, trying to hit him with the wall jump back airs, but Ice is very Ice ready is for so that. so fast right now. Yeah, and he's... Oh, he's just wobbling him. Oh, but he got the oh. turn around up either. <laughs> Amsa showing he's no slouch with his uh, modern chic tech. I call it the wobble because Pipsqueak was calling it the wobble. <laughs> but in the Peach matchup, actually, which is similar. Ooh. Ooh. Edge guard opportunity for Amsa, but he commits to the yeah. ledge and Ice notices and goes up. He takes the high ground. Yes. Then there's no beating the higher ground as we all learned from episode 3. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Catches Amsa hanging on the ledge for a bit too long and just down smashes him there. Keeping him honest. Oh, <laughs> this type of tomahawk. Yeah, Ice is looking crisp right now. <laughs> They're just dancing, yeah, trading positions it. on the edge. Two but ice. Oh, for ice. Damn, Amsa has had so much trouble just controlling the beast. That seems uh, unable to uh, thaw him properly here. Yeah. Taking uh, the fist to the chin. And a sip of water, trying to find some answers here. Now to deal with this uh, crafty, speedy German opponent of his. Mm. Taking a moment, taking a breath, which is an underrated thing to do, and something I noticed that top players are much better at than you know mid-range players. Yeah, yeah. Just uh, if you're not quite in it, just take a moment, collect yourself, and yeah. then go back in. Empty with, uh, your mind. With purpose. Or fill your mind. Depends. Yeah. Some players do better. Open like, your mind. Some players are thinkers. Some others are feelers. <laughs> Instinct. Yeah. I don't know. I think we should find a better name for them than feelers. But I, I get what you're saying. <laughs> They're the feels. <laughs> the feelers. <laughs> oh, what? Did you see that SDI? Yeah, that he was... He teleported. Nuts. Back throw fair from Ice here. <laughs> Ice is uh, just feeling himself right oh. now. Fully charged up smash. Gonna get the kill at 114% even in PAL. It's it's not even been 50 seconds. No. And two stocks have already oh, been erased from throw. Amsa here. Yeah, this time he hits him. Ice missing. Oh, and he goes all the way down oh, there. Will he make it back? And he does. Nice. Very important. Very Good important. Angle. Sheik has angles too, guys. <laughs> I was uh, actually it looked like Amsa <laughs> was gonna hit so that up smash. Fast. Yeah, Ice when he he gets in the groove, it's, oh, it's very hard what? to shut him down. Stop. <laughs> wow. I I don't even know what to say. It's yeah. just he's just like on a different speed. Yeah, and Amsa hit him with this very clutch back air there, but just because he's I started his up B. Like high enough they're like, to anticipate that. There are like two drag racers, but one is on the third gear and the other is like on the sixth gear mm -hmm. or something. Just like. trying to play catch up. Yeah. yeah. Both players cautious here. Yeah. And then going in at the same time and trading, and Amsa ooh, makes it back to the ledge there. Oh. But runs into an up smash, and Amsa can only laugh. <laughs> How are you supposed to deal with this? That, you're dead to an up that, smash, that, you're dead to an up throw. That was the call out. Ooh, I'm sorry. Gets a grab though. It was a bit late with the shield drop. Probably hoping to get an aerial there, but wisely uh, readjusted. <laughs> I like that extra laser just before the grab. <laughs> Just for Just good measure. Extra credit. Oh, and that was so unfortunate. Yeah. Amsa was a <laughs> centimeter too far to the left to actually hit that needle. You saw the needle disappear yeah. right in front of Ice's face. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's unfortunate. Wow. Okay, Amsa, gonna clean up this edge guard. Yeah. Oh no, no oh. that's unfortunate. And Amsa. <laughs> Poor Amsa. Yeah. And um, there we go. Yeah, you could see all the ideas were right, and it's just slightly off. And ice with these crazy <laughs> angles, making it so difficult for Amsa, and moves in to grand finals with a three stock victory in the final game there, 3-0 mm. over his old rival. But they're uh, having fun. You see, they're uh, laughing about it, smiling. And um, but here we are. We're at our grand finals. Yes. This whole mm. tournament has led up to this. Mm. 
Ice versus Leffen. It was destiny. Former teammates, now opponents. Leffen. I mean, they've frequently been opponents, even when they were teammates. Yeah. So.